So, <laughs> so this is what we are on with today. We are back on the extension. I'm on my own today. All we got to do is run in this little panel here. On Monday, we had a big push to get this done. It was just me and a labourer. So that went pretty well. And then later on today, just need to fill this in. And then maybe we'll get on a bit of block work. lay the opposite way so I used to push onto my brick and now I pretty much always work on my own I found that when I lay this way button up to my brick my joints are just loads fuller to make pointing easier I just prefer it this way now it's a bit tight that one what happened there then Isaac where did I lose you So 20 to 11, all done here, which is cool. So now we're probably going to go transfer inside because I've got a load of blocks to lay. So I reckon we'll transfer inside, whack a couple of corners up here and over there. And then probably last hour, hour and a half, we'll get this up here. because I still need to put my star packs up and my vertical damp. But yeah, overall, it's going pretty well today. So let's crack on, do some block work corners. When I lay this block up against this one, I hold that one on the trowel. Just so that block don't push that block back out of plumb.
Yeah, so I think the recording must have cut out after about 10 minutes. But eight high corner block work done, all sorted. I think so. Hey. <laughs> all spot on, that's what we like. Set my window out as well, which is uh, always nice to do. So yeah, all good. Reckon, might have a cup of tea now. Point this up first. There we go. All done, all pointed. I'm gonna show you guys a little trick. <laughs> and it is so basic, but it'll make people think that you are much better than you are. <laughs> the trick is that if you tie up a bit of work you've done, right, I feel bad, I could just leave it like this and I have to know to. But you know if you just spend 30 seconds sweeping up and making your work area clean and tidy, regardless of how good or how bad your work is, people will think you're a better travel for it. I know it sounds really stupid really simple but done that a little better the same work but it's just tidy so that's just like a little tip if you clean up <laughs> i should really take my own advice but if you clean up as you go or when you leave your work it looks so much better anyway fucking what am i about <laughs> i've been stung like three times today and i was wondering why there's like a full-on wasp nest over there joke. I mean, how easy is that? Because normally you just get loads of splash. I can guarantee everyone has a burn bin in England behind their house. It's just a burn bin lid. I think Bell do actually do a proper cover, but this has got a hole for your hose pipe. It's perfect. And then, yeah, it looks like this. So, yeah, sand just saves a lot of mess, and especially if you wet your barrel under it. Yeah, I've got one for free. I was gonna throw a dead man and do a load of block work, but it's getting a bit late on in the day, and the scaffold is coming tomorrow, so I need to make sure the scaffold's empty and clean for them. So, I've just thrown up this profile here, got some brand new Dutch pins, which are mint. This is my favourite profile setup because it makes running in internal corners super quick. So I'm about to blast in this front, tidy up, and then we'll be going home. see me do a double perf on my last pick. So that's what I always do on my last brick. That's gonna perp, that's gonna perp, perp, perp. And just when I push it in it just makes sure my joints are really full. Otherwise if you only perp one brick you can see straight through your perps. So that's just how I want to do it. Thousand subscribers. <laughs> That's mad, that is. Can't believe it. Thanks, 
for F1 for supporting us and that. watching other Brickies because it takes so much up from watching other people. I've only worked with let's say about 10 trials but if you've got like a few thousand Brickies watching your video um, you know you're bound to tell you something a different way of doing something So we are done all up to height nice full joint so quick point up here and then tidy up and then we are out of here right let's crack on with some pointing fully you end up knitting things that I like to do everything in one go. Perks, then beds, then tits. Bit of titting. Can't you? Okay, so we are done for today. Got that panel up nicely pointed. Clean the scaffold a little bit. We got all that done there as well. So overall not a bad day. Ready for the next lift of scaffold to go up. So was it? Sand. Thanks a lot for all the support guys, really appreciate it. A thousand subscribers, buzzing. Right, I will catch you in the next one.